And now then, YouTube, today's episode is going to be the FA Cup final, followed by the final two simulated Premier League games against um, Leeds and I believe it was Watford. Yes. The next episode will be the final ever episode of this career mode, what will be the Champions League final. There's the team. Everyone in it is 100% fully fit because I arrested them for a defeat against a shit Forest side. Fuming. If I simulation, last episode was called simulate equals defeat, because you've got absolutely no chance. And it absolutely infuriates me. Let's do it, FA Cup final day. I thought there was a gap there big enough to squeeze through. Chapolini and make sure there isn't one big enough to squeeze through for them. Noosa. Lovely ball. The youngster growing up. This was the day that every young footballer dreamt of. Playing in the FA Cup by opportunity. Dubois. Terrific piece of goalkeeping. Forcing the early save from Aaron Ramsdale. Can he deliver it with accuracy? And still dangerous. Can he convert? Simon. The goalkeeper in charge of the situation. Good start. First six minutes. We've got two early shots off. Two good saves from Ramsdale. Not all that convincing defensively. Was never likely to be in trouble. An odd attempt there from that was Matthias Fernandez, but again Ramsdale. Moving the ball forward with purpose. And let's give credit to the defending. Leroy Zane. Well done, Ricky. After that fantastic effort, it's gone out for a throw in. Plenty of pre-match talk from the pundits as regards... And Carpe, somebody with Liverpool have been linked with a tad in real life. ...could be his final season. Could it be, Stuart? He's about to hang up his boots. Oh, Derek, big moment here. That's a great, great save shot. from Becker. And his reflexes are so good there. That's a fantastic stop. In the short corner, let's see. Splendid defending, and it needed to be. Oh, the threat is there. And really trying ah. to blast that one past the keeper, but his radar was a bit off. And you can just tell there why it matters to make sure your team's on full stamina at the start of the game, because Arsenal aren't. And their defender felt so sluggish there. Look at Simon here. Comfortably dealing with Gabriel Jesus. There's not much in the fitness, but it's enough. It is enough. For example, Tielemans outplacing Tomiyasu. Dubois. Oh. <sighs> nice little toe in there from the Arsenal man. This attack looks highly promising. Excellent ball over the top. Siankov deflected. Well, Onto the bar. Dubois got a lovely little touch there ahead of his man. Oh my god! Why didn't he? What? Dubois just hit it. That's what I wanted to do the first time. Dubois. Can't believe what I just witnessed. Noosa. Dubois again. Flick at it. It's a deft touch. It's a really good save. Dubois. Fantastic from TD Mons. Fantastic from Noosa. Fantastic for the whole team working hard. Excellent use of the ball as Dubois. Shit. Well, such a high 
with how he's been playing lately. Every big game, he's got a goal. We're putting Arsenal under pressure now, forcing them long. Even then, they can't get out. Simon. Now, what can they do with the ball? Tielemans. Wonderful chance. Dubois. Oh, yes. <laughs> it's been coming. It's been deserved. That is for sure. And we are 1 0 up 20 seconds in to first half stoppage time. And who is it? Who is it? You don't even need me to tell you. You don't even need to be watching the video. And you could just assume, and you'd probably assume right, it's number 15, it's Yannick Dubois. It's, imp it's impeccable, as always. It's expected. It's brilliant. That'll do, get a suave time, Suarez, well done. It's just absolute class. He is class. French thunderstorms for Arsenal at the moment. It's absolute Back class from Yannick Dubois. Well, it's French thunderstorms for every team that he comes up against at the moment. He is unstoppable. He is quite incredible. He's brilliant. He is just unbelievable. This man has come from nothing. Youth player. Thought I'd give him a go. Saw his potential. Thought, yeah, i got to give him a go. Looks class. And well, he saved me a hell of a lot of money. It's another great shot, well saved. He has saved me 78 to million that I would have had to spend on a decent striker. Found one in the youth academy for free. Fantastic. Tielemans. Suarez. Palini's got half a yard. Good strike, well saved. We've dominated this game from start to finish. It's not even funny how good this team I've built is. Simon, another unbelievable header. Arsenal fans getting frustrated, unsurprisingly. Dubois can't quite get to that. Oh, and here finally Arsenal come. Suarez says no. They barely get over the halfway line, and here we come again. Dubois. Ah, oh, I thought I got that there with Ricky. Simon, just over the halfway line again. And back over we come. For a cup final, this is ridiculous. Dominance in this final. Fernandez. Double save, Ramsdale. What a keeper. It's a good job he is, what a keeper. Because if he wasn't, it'd be what a performance game over. Whereas there's still a chance here for Arsenal. There shouldn't be, because we've battered them. We're not far wide. Worryingly close, in fact. Arias is going to come on for Noosa. Just to freshen those legs up on that far side. Well, the Near side, shall I say. Ricky. Fouled, but we'll play on. Wish I hadn't now. Ooh, nice team on. Fantastic. No. Took him this long, but we're finally getting sloppy, and they're finally getting a touch on the ball. Save and Sesho can come on. Morton and Anana too. Santos fucking Terreras. And that'll do. In the short corner, let's see. Goretzka, superb save. Well, he should Good save. That's a brilliant save. Favoring the short one. Brilliantly blocked. Santos as well. Now 
I don't like this because we have absolutely, up until the 70th minute, battered Arsenal. It should have been 3 or 4 nil. But here they are. Here they come. Dragging the shot wide. Morton. Opportunity to deliver the cross. Will it be? Arias. Palinia. Just missing narrowly on the volley. Well, it's a fantastic effort. Difficult technique, but he caught it so well. He's unfortunate. And don't forget, we have more Premier League action coming up for you on EA TV. It's Arsenal taking on Fantastic. Watford. Well, Dennis, I'm really looking forward to it. Always a great atmosphere in that Santos. Stadium, it Unbelievable defending. The whole team in attack, in defence. Besides that, when it hit Ricky's backside. Substitution time it is here. Going well. Ricky did well enough. Well. well, that's a big opportunity miss, and you have to question whether they'll get another. Time very much ebbing away now. He's using his body to good effect. The players waiting in the middle. And after that Four minutes. So. Deserves credit for winning the ball back. Advantage, Arsenal. Blow the whistle. Santos with a tackle the of immense importance. And that is the FA Cup. Come on. That scoreline is ridiculously flattering. And that goal scorer. Is ridiculously predictable. Well, just look at those scenes down there, Derek. Cheers. Brilliant for the winners, despair for the losers. But overall, the right team won today. Oh dear. Yeah, you can see what it means to this tight Ooh. team. Real solidarity. Get in there. The trophy. I was desperate to win. And here we are. We get to see the captain. Bitsyankov lift it. Last year, we won the Carabao Cup, the Champion, the Europa League, sorry, and the Premier League. There were two trophies waiting to be won. The FA Cup and the Champions League, and the FA Cup is complete. Next episode, we see if we can successfully complete the lot. Can we win every trophy? The only trophy we won't have won will have been the uh, Super Cup, where we lost um, at the beginning of this season. Don't want to manage New Zealand. Don't want to manage Sweden. Uh, manage Sweden either. Sorry. Will it meet in the demands? You just want FA Cup. Shut the fuck up. Yeah. So everything we have won, besides the. Uh, Super Cup player, as you can see here, we lost to Liverpool 2 0. Beat, beat Palace in the Community Shield, but uh, lost to Liverpool 2 0. So, play highlights to win all but one trophy in the five majors Europa, Champions, Prem, Carabao, and FA, with Community Shield as well. Hello All that I missed out on was the Super Cup. I count that as a success. Disappointed finish to the uh, Premier League for us, but that probably wouldn't have been the case if I didn't. Re <laughs> if I actually realised how soon. Um, that was close to being over the line. Incisive pass. This looks interesting. Oh, he's through here. 
It was a lovely touch. Shit shot. Come on. That's a good cross. Has to be. Oh, good looking run. Must be. Oh, piss off. EA. Don't tell me you're not scripted, because you are. You just are. That was falling perfectly to my player's feet. And you stop it. You are. Fuck off, EA. That's justice, because as soon as the keeper touched that ball, the attack was over. And it was falling right to my player's feet. Another attack, though. On the owl mark. And a long way out. Not far away. I don't know what sort of positions it puts your players in, but it's ridiculous. Being egged on by the crowd. <laughs> Free kick for Leeds. <laughs> Quite simply, nothing I can do here. Except watch. What worries me. It makes me feel like they're going to score. Great save, Becker. Free kick for us. I'm not fucking crossing it straight into the box because it'll just end the attack. Glorious. See, instead of volleying it, sank off past it. What means the penultimate Prem game of the season finishes. In a 1 0 away win at Ellen Road. Thanks to a lovely finish from Yannick Dubois. Should have been two, but EA decided to stop the attacking phase of play once the ball was going to fall to me, coming towards an empty net. Really appreciate that. We've got Watford next in the final Prem game. And the final game of this recording session. Let's do it. Thank you, all of you, for your support. Uh, yeah, the penultimate ever video of this career mode. Final one. Next episode, on to be in the Champions League final. At least we've got a winnable game. I mean, the toughest game in the group was the round of 16. Sorry. In the in the knockout round. It got hard. It started with the hardest and got easier. Barca. Then Ajax. Then Leverkusen. Oh, dear. 1 0 Watford. They start as they mean to continue. How Zerman just stood there and just stuck his foot out, got the ball off Noosa when he took a quick touch like that. And over it comes. Not away completely. What? I need to understand the logic of this game. Because it didn't give the ball away when I thought it would. This could be the equaliser. Well, what an opportunity, but really good defending, you've got to say. 1 0 down undeservedly to Watford. Yannick Dubois. Shut these fucking dirty bastards up. 1 1. That's for all the fucking disgusting tackles you made in that FA Cup um, semi final. It was ridiculous how disgusting this team was. Very quick thinking there. I see Siankov. And now. Fuck off. Crossed off duty for Derby County. And if I don't get this, we're not going to win our final Premier League game. Really 
There they go again. Fuck off. Oh, fuck off. Fantastic from Zienko. 1 1, robbed. And that's how the Premier League finishes. Not the way I wanted it to finish, but the way I probably expected it to finish with how scripted it's been ever since I've started simulating results and uh, only playing highlights. Bullshit from EA of the highest calibre. Won't expect it again, but a fucking joke. Anyway, we'll look at the table next episode. We'll complete the season fully next episode. And there it is, the final ever career mode game. We've got Benfica. Thank you so much for your support. I shall see you next episode for the final ever, not only FIFA 23 game, but FIFA game before we then become EAFC. It's going to be Derby versus Benfica, and I'll see you next episode for it. Like, subscribe, take care, and bye-bye.